Hi everyone, M Tash here with a very quick Tips with Tash video that I think you are going to enjoy. There are some absolutely filthy snipes in this one, there are some absolutely terrible decisions on my part, and I think you can definitely learn something from this game. So let's break it down, give you some uh, examples on things I could have done better, and things that you should try to implement in your game. So a couple of these clips you might find similar because they were in my uh, radar usage video. Now right there, that was a pretty nice quick scope, nice little sniper. And uh, right there, I saw someone running up the stairs there, weak. So I threw a grenade. I actually didn't throw it far enough, but I got him anyways with the old sniper. So right here, I'm actually taking a very aggressive angle there. As soon as I saw that grenade, I should have ran. And although it doesn't get me killed, that was just a very uh, lazy situation. I should have definitely ran sooner, and I was taking a very bad sniper angle. So right here, I wish I would have gotten this kill just because I, I would have actually gotten away in this situation with a nice little kill, but I died at the Blade Dancer, and that's okay. I could have blinked a little bit quicker, um, and you know what, honestly, I think that's the only reason I died is I didn't instantly blink there. I was trying to do a, a forward blink, but uh, that's fine. So right here, I'm just kind of hard scoping that area, waiting for him to pop out. As soon as you see, him, see someone on the radar, um, you want to be hard scoping the area they're coming from. Uh, just because it gives you an advantage and it allows you to start shooting first and usually win trades. I survived that shoulder charge out of sheer luck and right there was a nice little sniper. Um, right here also, very risky that I'm hard scoping here. I should have just ran, but as soon as I recognize the grenade go out, I do. And then I pop the Blade Dancer because there is so much traffic up here. I, I do not want to stay up here um, low health or without a super up or anything like that because it's going to be impossible to hold down. So right there is pretty good, but I recognize my Blade Dancer is up. There's a guy sliding in, uh, people going for rockets, and I just have to get out of here. There's no way I can contest this. I was thinking about sniping, but I just start to run, and I think that was the play. I didn't die there, I lived to fight another day, and yep, I lost rockets. But I'm still alive and able to be um, a pressure around the map. Hopefully kill some people so that the rocket guy can't kind of thing. Um, right there was a pretty good engagement. I mean, the guys that I'm playing against don't have the best guns, but right here is a big error. Boom, boom. See, I actually shot him there a couple times when he was in the air. I did a bunch of damage, and he was almost dead. But I threw out a melee there because I, I thought he was going to be up on top of me. I needed to just keep shooting my gun. He would have been dead, and that was just a misread by me on how much health and how much damage I had done. Right here, a very aggressive blink there. I did not need to blink. And I actually put myself... Um, in a position where, you know, if he had a shotgun or something like that, maybe he would have turned on me, slid into me. I don't know. It just, what I did there was just so aggressive. And right here, you saw in my video before, I'm in a pinch situation. So I decide to change, turn on the guy that is the major threat, the guy coming behind me. And then I'm able to gra uh, grab some distance and then snipe the guy with the heavy. So that was a great play. I get a, a nice little triple there, you know, delayed triple. But um, without reading the radar there, I never would have survived that. So at this point, we have a bit of a lead, but the other guys, you know, they had heavy, so uh, they got some kills, but I've got my super now. So it is time to uh, hopefully get a couple more kills, but I really want to get this super used up. And so we're going to push top mid, get to where the traffic is, and try and blow my super. That's usually the plan once you've got a super this late in the game is get it used up. But watch this. I blink right into him, and I miss. He blinks away, and now I am going left to right. I'm trying to be mobile, but I die. I get outplayed by someone who doesn't even use a shotgun. He's using a fusion rifle. And that is just honestly a misplay by me. I was so aggressive on him. And, um, you know, I blinked in onto him when I didn't have my Blade Dancer up. And the delay was enough that he could blink away from me. So right here, I wanted to note this play. What am I doing there? I was standing in an absolutely useless position. There was guys pushing me from the right side and the left side. And honestly, I am I'm so pinched here because I, I was in la-la land. I'm not paying attention to my radar. I was standing there just kind of eating shots for a bit. And at this point, I'm just trying to back up and play safe. So I didn't get the kill there. And I don't deserve to get the kill there. Thank God I didn't get the kill there because I'm using last word at a distance. I'm not sure why I don't have my sniper out when he was that far away. And at this point, I recognize, okay, well, everyone dipped. It's uh, it's time to, you know, make a move, start transitioning. And right there, I actually thought he was going to be around the corners. That's why I kind of took a, a pause there. But right here, I'm being really aggressive. And one of the reasons why is because it's a close game. So I'm trying to be super aggressive here. And right here, watch. 
like this positioning here is, is stupid. I'm in the worst position. And then I realize I'm pinched. I'm in the middle of the map. So I'm just frantically blinking around. And you know what? The fact that I survived here is just sheer luck. I was in an awful position. And thank God I was able to clean up a couple kills here. Or, well, one kill. But I get heavy here and I don't deserve it. The way I played that heavy round was extremely aggressive. I was, you know, hard scoping in a very vulnerable position. And overall, it was just not the, uh, the, the play to make. And right there, again, I pushed out into the middle chasing that guy, and I took a bunch of damage. I could have easily died. Especially in a close game like this, that is just not acceptable. I do close it out with some rockets, but there's just some positional play where, you know, I was just off for whatever reason. I had some cool snipes, and the game was pretty good, but I needed to be a little bit better with my positioning. I stood out into open areas where I didn't need to, and um, those things need to be fixed. I highly recommend if you do have gameplays, watch your gameplays and break them down like this. It will help you tremendously. If you don't take the time to look at your mistakes like this and recognize when your positioning is bad or when you pop out and engage on someone when you shouldn't, you're never going to improve. Thanks again. See you later, my friends, and have a good day. Bye-bye.